Hi guys, I'm Bobsy, and in this video I'm going to show you how you synchronize animations over the network. So first things first, I've made this little animated character here. It's the exact same as the character that we've made in the previous one. However, this one just has a character that actually has an animator that, you know, does animate. And in the movement script, I've only adjusted it to take in the animator. And then it just sets the values of the speed and is grounded bool. And that's really all that I'm handling right now. So if I go and start the game and I spawn these new characters instead, you can see now we have these characters which are animated. However, the issue is when the client moves around, he's clearly not animated. And that's because since we're updating this in the update loop and the script is, dis is disabled, we don't actually get these values. And these values are only calculated on the client as well. So we need to do a little bit of manipulation to this. However, Pernet allows for very easy handling of this, similar to how systems like Mira and Fishnet also allows for easy networking. We also have what's called a network animator. And this should automatically just tap into your animator. So you can see now it has the reference to the animator here. And it will automatically just network your variables. So you can see the parameters that I've set up here, which is speed and is grounded. These should now automatically be networked and synchronized. However, the animators also have triggers, which it's not atypical that you'd use that for a jump, and that wouldn't work with this method, similar to in other systems. However, I also do recommend in general that this is very easy to do, that instead of referencing your animator, you can keep your exact same code, you just reference the network animator. And as you can see, the code will still work, and all the variables will now just be handled through the network animator, which I personally think is cleaner. So the only thing I now have to do is just go change that reference to drag it in here, and that's it. And now the whole thing should be networked. So you can see my local animations still work just fine. And when the client joins, you can see he can also run around and the animations work just fine now. And it's really as easy as that to just network animations with Pernet. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions or any issues with this. I'll be more than happy to help you out. The assets are just from Kenny.nl, which is an amazing website for free assets. And other than that, I just hope that you had a wonderful day.